Hi everyone, in today's video I'm going to show you how to make this easy cup cozy. It's made in a cross stitch. And when I learned how to crochet last year, this is the first project I made. So that's the first one I made. Um, you're going to need, I'm using some cotton yarn, a pair of scissors, 5mm hook, and a needle. Okay, so I'll show you how I do it. To start, you want to take two strands of yarn, so you can either have two different colours, or I've just taken one from the centre and one from the outside. Okay, make a slip knot. And then you want to chain 30. Alright, once you've chained 30, then you just want to join the two ends together. So make sure that you don't twist it. Put your hook in the last chain. And make a slip stitch. Okay, so for this cup cozy we're going to do cross stitch, so I'm just going to chain one and I'm going to go back into the, the chain that we slip stitched into. Okay, and then instead of putting my yarn on top of the hook, I'm going to put it behind Pull it through, yarn over, and pull through the last two. Okay, so go into the next stitch, put the yarn behind the hook, yarn over, pull it through, yarn over, and pull through those two loops. Okay, so we're going to do one cross stitch in each chain. So you should end up with 30 cross stitches at the end of this row. I'll leave a link in the description for my cross stitch video as well.
Okay, so if you find that 30 stitches isn't big enough for the bottom of your cup, you can just chain a couple more. Um, so I'm not ca counting the slip stitch or the chain one, and then I'm just going to keep going, go into the top of this cross stitch, and make another one. Okay, so I'm just going to one cross stitch in each stitch, and I'm going to do that for six rows. Okay, I'll come back and show you how it looks after that. Okay, so here's how it looks after my six rows, and you can tell when you've finished a row because of the starting tail. Okay, so it's a tight fit but that's what you want for your cup so it doesn't slide off okay and the next row we're going to um, make an increase okay so this is because the cup gets wider at the top so in this stitch here all we need to do is make two cross stitches so there's one, and then go back into that one, and make another one. Okay. So for this row, you should have 31 stitches at the end. Okay, so you know when you finish that row because you can see the increase. So I've stopped just before it. So now that we have 31, we've increased to 31. I'm just going to do one row of single cross stitch. So just one in each stitch. Okay, so I'll do that and then I'll come back and show you what to do next. Alright, so I've done my one row of 31 cross stitches. In the next row, I'm going to cross stitch 15. Okay, and then in this next stitch, I'm going to do an increase, which is two cross stitches in the same stitch. And then I'm going to continue to the end of the row. Okay, so at the end of this row, you should have 32. Okay, so now that I have 32 stitches around, I'm just going to do one row of 32. So just one in each stitch. Okay, I'll do that and now I'll come back and show you how it looks. Okay, so here's how it looks. In this next row, I'm going to put one increase. And I'm going to cross stitch 15.
after you've done 15 I'm going to put in another increase so this row will go from from 32 to 34 and then I'm just going to cross stitch one in each stitch until I get back to the start Okay, once I've increased to 34, I'm just going to do one row of cross stitch, so just one in each stitch again. Alright, in this next row I'm going to cross stitch 9. And then in the next stitch, I'm going to do an increase. Then I'm going to cross stitch 14. And then in the next stitch, I'm going to do an increase. And then I'm just going to cross stitch back to the start. Okay, so you should have increased from 34 to 36 because we've put two increases in. So you just need to cross stitch 36. One in each stitch. Okay, so that's how it looks at the end. Oh yeah. And the only other thing you want to do is cut the yarn. Cut the yarn. Pull this through. And then skip the stitch and go into the second stitch. Whoa, this was you did the stitch. And then go back into the last one you did and just go through the back loops. Okay, and you just want to hide these two end tails on the inside of your cup cozy. Okay, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.